Hey YouTube, it's SJ and I'm back with probably my final Nike SB pickup of the year. It is a good one, people. It's a good one. You've seen the title, you know what it is. But let's go to this camera here and do the reading of the box. These are a Nike SB Zoom Blazer Low Quick Strike. They are light cream, light cream black, code CZ4620200. They are US 7.5, which makes me UK 6.5, European 40.5. Do we know what they are? Yes, of course we know what they are. Back to the middle camera, people, because I'm super excited to, to get these. And, oh my word, they are good people. This is my New Year's Eve sneaker, well and truly sorted. I'm really excited. It is the Medicon Bear Brick Blazer. Oh, so, so good. I'm gonna be even more twinning with the dog in these than I normally am. <laughs> Just look at that, that looks so nice on camera. Now. Medicon and Nike SB have collaborated since way back when in the noughties. Um, and if you remember way back earlier in this year, 2020, God, I forget what year it is. Uh, Medicon and Nike SB did the dunk, which Mr. B has. Didn't make it that far through in our Nike SB dunk of the year, but super clean dunk. And this is the blazer from that pack kind of forgot they were coming because it has been a while since those images we, we first saw way back when. So it was a nice end of year surprise for these to drop and for me to get a massive shout out to Attitude for the win on these. Now let's go up to this camera here because I want to show you all the details. Look at that. So it's a really, really nice, same as the black pair that were out earlier this year, the, the Dunks. It uses, Mr. B's just taken that right in so you can see it. These use that really nice, I'm not sure if it's pony hair or calf hair material. And that is just really nice in this sort of creamy color. Then of course you've got the Bear Brick logo here. Nike swoosh in that lovely furry hair as well. Look at the front there. It just really shows up more than the black actually and then if I spin it round just like super super clean now on the uh, the uh, aglets I always get this wrong I have to bring this right in and Mr B just put his fingers across the camera there can you see the end there sort of yeah I'm getting nods behind the camera I'm actually gonna have a quick look see what it says I don't think it says anything it's just got like triangles on it I think yeah, it has. It's just got triangles, but just really nice to, to see the, the ends, the aglets finished off. Then at the back, you've got Nike in Mr. B's hand coming in, in the black pony hair. Just really, really nice. I mean, you can't go wrong with a monochrome pair of sneakers and just having it, look at that, in these materials just like makes them a little bit special just super nice super clean and we're going to take it back to the center here now i'm just going to take the paper out now again you've got the same as the dunk you've got if you can see that in the middle there we go you've got the the bare brick in the middle there and then i'm just going to tilt it forward because you've got exactly the same line in the I think it's the same anyway, that Mr. B had on his dunks. I'm just gonna bring it up to this, there you go, you can see it now. Oh yeah, that's exactly the same, I think, as what was in the dunks. I'm not gonna take it out though, because I don't like doing that, and Mr. B is doing some weird, what are you trying to do, he's all right, doing circles. I don't know what he's doing. You want me to flip it up? You want me to flip it that way? Why didn't you just say <laughs> flip it up? There you go, Nike SB Bear Brick. You can see it and it says Medicon Toy. I'm just gonna bring that in even more and it says 2020 Medicon Toy in there. There we go, you can see it. And back to the middle. But yeah, super, super clean blazer. Really, really nice. I really like the laces as well. They're, they're sort of, this 
material, the sort of pony calf hair, while it is this sort of off-white, under these lights, it almost has like a golden tone to it. And you can, I really like the fat laces that they've been using on blazers. They don't look as fat as the GT laces. Mr. B sort of doing a, mm, mm, I don't think they are. I just don't think they're quite as, fl as, as fat. Fat, flat, <laughs> can't, can't talk. I'm just gonna get the other one out. Now we've got, why? Why even bother, right? Why would you put, like, the world's, can you see that? The world's thinnest laces. I'm just gonna come up to this camera here and hopefully you can see it. They are super thin. Like, that's ridiculous. But they have got silver aglets. Now, I think they should have put in a black alternate lace, maybe. Like a fat black alternate lace with the gold aglets would have been really nice but that's just like why bother nike sb but we haven't seen a plastic lace bag for a while on a pair of nike sbs i think mr b actually commented on that recently so it's the first time we've seen a plastic nike sb bag but back to the center again just a super super nice pair of blazers just taking the paper out i'm just having a quick scan for quality because a couple of pairs of blazers I've had, the quality hasn't been the best. These I've got a nice, I'm just gonna bring this up to the camera, I don't know if you can see that there. Got, I think it's a leather, white leather interior as well. I'm gonna come up to this one, because there, yeah, you can see it better there. White leather interior around the edge there. Just super clean. But the quality overall on these looks pretty good. I'm not seeing any obvious issues. I mean, there's a little bit of, I think it's just, no, if I show you there, you can see that. A couple of little bits, maybe. I think it just maybe when I've been in the box, to be honest, where a sort of pony hair, calf hair has had a, a little bit of a, um, it may have just touched the, the edge of the box or something. There you go. But no, I mean, these are I mean, I'm struggling to find anything obviously wrong. I'm being a bit nitpicky <laughs> just just because some of the others I've had. Now, I did go up, again, half size on these because I found, for whatever reason, blazers have felt a little bit tight over the last couple of months. So the last few pairs I've bought, I've gone up half a size just to give me that little bit of extra room. Um, Dunks I'm fine with, blazers, I don't know, they just feel like they're coming up a little bit small. Um, so I went up half size again in these and these look like they will fit absolutely fine. But yeah, just super, super nice clean blazer. As we keep saying, Nike SB have been on fire this year, not only with the dunks, but with the blazers as well. Now, I'm super pleased I got these ending this year on a blazer high and I will be wearing these on New Year's Eve around the house. Might not be going anywhere, but I'm putting on a pair of fire sneakers, that's for sure. And I don't really have anything else to say on these other than it is a super clean blazer. Great way to end the year. So on that one, I am over and out. Don't forget to join us though on Sneaker Streaming Sundays, which is 12 p.m. on the West Coast. 3 p.m. on the East Coast, 8 p.m. here in the UK. And if you haven't already, hit the old like, subscribe, leave us a comment below. Did you did you get manage to pick these up as your final pickup of the year? What do you think of these? What do you think of these over the dunk that dropped earlier in the year? Blazer of the year, do we think? Oof, that's tough now because, you know, most people have done their sneakers of the year, but you know, this has dropped pretty late and it's quite a contender, I would say, for Blaze of the Year. So, uh, so yeah, leave us a comment, let us know your thoughts and all the rest of it. And uh, before you go, go and check out one of the vi other videos, which will probably appear just over here somewhere. Go on, you know you wanna have a look. Catch you later.